The Parliamentary Select Committee on Defense and Interior says it will help ensure that all the country's legal and major entry posts are better resourced to handle any suspected e case of Ebola. The chairman of the committee, Fritz Bafo, and his team have toured the Aflao border post to assess the security situation and the level of preparedness to handle Ebola. Gradually, the Ebola virus seems to be transcending into every sphere and international points in the country. The visit comes in the wake of the porous security situation at the border post. Security at the Aflao border post in the Volta region is not very encouraging. Togolese border security officials have unlawfully created unapproved routes along the side of the border and extort monies from people who use them in and out of the two countries. This, according to the security agency's man in the border post, poses a great threat to the country's security. Additionally, officials lack the adequate capacity to detect suspected persons with the deadly Ebola disease at the Aflao border post and any other legal entry point in the Volta region. Briefing the committee, the Volta Regional Health Director, Dr. Joseph Te Nuete, said the Fort Health Department has been screening travelers at the Aflao border and Beat 9. He, however, expressed worry about the inadequacy of the personal protection equipment and called for more supplies from the government. My information is that the immigration and such officials see the traveler before he gets to the fourth health official, which is an anomaly. And I think that that should have to be reversed. The various security agencies charged with manning the post also briefed the committee. They all agreed that apart from the appalling nature of infrastructure, coupled with inadequate logistics, the porous nature of the border can serve as a conduit for a possible outbreak of the disease in the country if urgent measures are not adopted. The chairman of the Parliamentary Select Committee for Defense and Interior, Fritz Bafo, called for more cooperation with state agencies tasked to man the country's border posts in efforts to ensure that the disease does not enter the country.